Water is not merely a resource in California, it is a lifeline, essential for sustaining ecosystems, agriculture, industry and human life. The state's complex network of rivers, lakes, aquifers and reservoirs serves as the backbone of its economy and communities. Understanding the ownership of this vital resource is crucial for comprehending California's water management landscape. California's economy, the largest in the United States, relies heavily on water. The state is a leading agricultural producer, responsible for a significant portion of the nation's fruits, vegetables and nuts. Moreover, water plays a fundamental role in sustaining ecosystems, protecting biodiversity and maintaining the state's natural beauty. The ownership of water in California is governed by a complex legal framework that balances competing interests and priorities. Additionally, water supports various industries, including technology, manufacturing and tourism. At its core are principles derived from Spanish and English common law, as well as indigenous water management practices. The state's water ownership system encompasses diverse rights and regulations including the Prior Appropriation Doctrine, Riparian Rights and Groundwater Regulation. Understanding these mechanisms is essential for navigating California's intricate water rights landscape. Imagine paying up to $2,000 for something that used to cost just $250. Today, we're exploring the complex and costly topic of water rights in California, a topic that affects local farmers, the state's economy and the environment. We'll look at how water prices have skyrocketed, identify the major players, and discuss what this means for the future of water in the region. First, let's talk numbers. In times of drought, water prices in California's Central Valley can soar to $2,000 per acre foot, a stark increase from the usual $250 in non-drought periods. At the extreme, some farmers have even sold their future water rights for up to $5,000 per acre foot. Now, Meet Stuart and Linda Resnick, the billionaire owners of the wonderful company. Known for their agricultural products like pistachios and pomegranate juice, the Resnicks are also key figures in the water market. They hold a majority stake in the Kern Water Bank, one of the largest underground water storage facilities in the state. This water bank plays a crucial role in managing California's water supply, storing large quantities underground for use when water is scarce. But what exactly is a water bank? It's essentially an underground reservoir where water is stored until needed. From the surface, these areas might look insignificant, like mere puddles, but beneath them lie vast amounts of water, crucial for agriculture and urban use during dry spells. To sum up, the soaring water prices in California's Central Valley highlight a critical issue, the growing scarcity and value of water, with major players like the Resnicks influencing the market through strategic storage and sales, Understanding this dynamic is key to predicting future trends in water availability and pricing. Thank you for joining us as we explored the intricate and high stakes world of California's water market. Remember, water is more than just a resource. It's an asset that shapes economies and lives.